Hello there, I'm the Rampant Mystic and welcome back to Imperium Galactic Survival. And as you can see today we are at still at Epsilon 3 instead of going to Epsilon 2 because Epsilon 2 is very dangerous. And we will eventually go there but you know what, I'm like a little bit tired of trying to take those things down so uh, we are going to this moon over here which does have a resource that we need. No it is not Neodymium but it is Cobalt and we are going to need Cobalt as well. So might as well find some here, right? And at least fill up, well, some inventory with it. Hopefully. Hopefully. Uh, but I'm assuming this place isn't going to be friendly towards us as well. This place seems to have unknown signal, unknown signal, okay. Problem is it's all showing up as a signal. Which means that I do have to look on the map. Alright, these are resource patches. Make sure you could find other... Oh, that's the wrong thing. Our thrusters not on. They are on. Okay, so we found some magnesium. We found some promethium. Now I did actually. There is a, there are drones here. But we do need promethium as well. Granted, we can't actually use these. I believe we can't use them on surface. So this means no mining. I mean, I can try, but. Oh, we can! Maybe I can use them on moons, but not anywhere else. Is the oxygen on? Yeah, it is. Okay. Alright, so there's the first Promethean. We don't need much for now. We will need more eventually, but for now, anything we have is fun. Oh, boy. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. I'm assuming it's gonna be faster than me uh, digging it with the drill, though. I hope. I mean, there could be a vessel that I specifically build for this, but we're currently on limited resources and I want to actually get into uh, uh, big vessel, capital vessel territory. Now we shouldn't actually need too much, as I said. How much room is this thing taking up? Oh, a decent chunk. So we're gonna leave it at probably like this. We're gonna go to like 30%. And I'll leave it like that. Oh my god, that's actually when I use the thrusters and the drills, it's maxing out the power. Come on, keep going with the Prometheum. I know you I know my wings are stuck. This isn't really a vessel meant for this. Alright, I think we're good. We're slightly above 30%, but that's fine. Alright, I keep pressing the wrong button. Why didn't that stack? That was weird. Alright, let's go find some cobalt. Actually, what did we find here? Silicone. No, that's fine. I don't really need that. I don't want to tango with the drone, so... Let's go find whatever else we can find around here. Magnesium and Promethium. Now, we do actually need some magnesium if I want to go into rockets. But we have some powder back at base and you really don't use, well at least to my knowledge, we don't really use magnesium for anything else. So I'm just gonna go and try and uh, keep finding cobalt. I do understand there's enemies here, but there's nothing much I can do about that. Not with this, at least. Alright, what is that? That's a cannon drone. Okay, we don't want to face that. I think it's heading straight towards us though. Alright. Let's see. We're getting some experience for uh, at least uh, finding these. No, no, no. Why are you firing at that? Oh, no. Alright, silicon. Iron, no. Iron and silicon and copper are uh, easy to. Promethium. Okay, it's gonna be mass promethium, isn't it? What's that? Okay. Okay. Oh, it's a cube. Anything uh, heading towards us? Okay, let's see what this is. Nothing is coming our way, except the thing that is coming our way. And nothing. Hmm. 
Oh no, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good at all. You know, come on, enter. Come, oh my, for the love of it. I hate this game. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Death by door! Have I mentioned recently that I hate this game? Oh, for the love of... Alright. Let's get out of here. Alright, anything chasing us? No. Alright, let me retract that and let's actually see if there's any damage done. Hopefully... Yeah, there is. Well, I was gonna replace those anyway, but... Still not fair. Dominium, I'm gonna need like four, ain't I? Oops, sorry about that. Just having the hiccups today. Great. Anything else that actually needs... to be repaired? Hopefully that was the only thing hit. Hopefully. I mean, I should absolutely make sure, but that, that's the wrong thing. This is the right thing, though. This way I should be able to tell if there's something going on. No, this one's not airtight, really. I doubt that. Okay, I think everything's okay. Uh, probably should have, uh, yeah, there it is. Okay, a little bit better. Maybe this got hit? No? Okay, yeah, all these inside here got hit, okay. Looks like a couple of these. Alright. Oh, that's the CP, alright, I was wondering what that was. Alright. Let's see, anything else nearby? Oh, there's nothing else to explore? Explore, really? Ah, oh, that's because, that's where we are. That explains it. That explains it. All right, let's let's uh, now continue on forward with our. Looks <laughs> looks like <laughs> looks like a black eye. <laughs> uh, oh, this ship. Sadly, she's gonna be punished a lot. I could, I guess, add a double layer of blocks, but that's gonna make the ship. Oh, great. It's gonna make the ship. That's a Pentax ID deposit. We don't care. Okay, just pass through. Do not attack. Never mind. Okay, we're not even gonna pass through there. Nope. 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 Prometheum, Prometheum. Okay, uh, found a station. Uh, Pentax ID, Magnesium, Prometheum, and nothing. I think there was something over there. Nope. It's next to a base. That's not happening. Why does every single deposit have a drone on it? Magnesium. I came here for cobalt. Actually, does this planet even have co cobalt? It should. Iron, magnesium. No, it doesn't. Wait a minute. Was I looking at the wrong thing? So I was looking here. I was selected the moon. Iron, silicone, <laughs> silicone, Prometheum. Did I go to the wrong moon? I went to the wrong moon, didn't I? I should have been at the other moon. Uh, I mean, actually, what does Epsilon have? So Epsilon has, are you pl please? So we have one for asteroids, means we have magnesium, titanium asteroids. Actually, we could go for a little bit of titanium as well. We are going to need a bunch of that. Oh, there's a cobalt. Oh, that's on the Eps. Oh, that's on Epsilon. That's not on the moon. Actually, it has neodymium as well. Copper, cobalt, neodymium. Well, would you look at that? We found our planet. Speaking of which, we should probably find an asteroid or two. I mean, I do need to actually land on this planet for... I don't know, whatever uh, that mission was. That was given to us by the captain of uh, the big ship. I don't really remember. What is that energy signature? It's a point of interest, but what is it? It's yellow. It's like the afraid of that. Alright. Unpower the weapons. There's no point in them. It's not like we're going to be doing much fighting. This isn't really a ship for fighting. 
Come on. I don't I want to know what these two are. Come on. I discovered something. Okay, it's a copper asteroid. And what is that? Syndicate. Oh, it's pirates. All right, yellow's pirates. Oh, well, off to the planet we go, I guess. Now, before we actually uh, go to the planet, I figured it might be a good idea. I turned off my helmet by accident. Uh, I figured it might be a good idea to check out these two wreckages here. They're very close, close by, and there is a purple energy signature, which we're definitely not gonna, not gonna even touch. Oh no, I discovered an asteroid. That's not good. And that's why it's not good, because the interdictor is going to come here. Alright, well we know what this is, at least, but I have no cores on me. I didn't bring any, right? Yeah, I brought none. Alright, let's leave. Oh, I was gonna explore it. I was gonna take the fuel from it, but no. <laughs> Uh, for some reason, this system spawns a lot of interdictors. I'm not entirely sure if it's just this system, or... Dry planets such as these can be a good source of neodymium needed to build your first capital vessel. Exactly what I was looking for, actually. Uh, speaking of which... Oh, great. It's next to a uh, drone. Wait. What did I turn off? I think I turned off the lights back. So, okay. Turn these on. Turn the lights back... Ah, off. Whatever. Okay. I'm gonna save, and then we're gonna tango. Alright, game has been saved. Let's try and tango. Range is 200 meters on this thing. We're not very maneuverable as well, so there's that. Come on. At least one drone we can take care of. Alright. We're good to go. I do want to actually uh, see what it, loot it holds. Is anything coming to get us now? No, does not look like it. All right. Could I please leave? Could I please leave? Thank you. I'm actually gonna extend that because we're gonna need it. Well, not bad. I mean, the I was about to say oscillators, but I forgot they're actually called advanced electronics here. The oscillators are very nice though. Now, yeah, Yadinium. That's gonna be interesting to farm. Let's see if I can do it with the ship. I doubt it, unless it's surface level, but it's neodymium, so it's not going to be. I mean, worst case scenario, at least, I dug a big hole, right? Where is that? Now it's 30 meters in. That's... Uh, oh, there's something coming for us, isn't there? I'm seeing red. No, there's nothing. That's the energy signatures, okay. So I'm gonna have to do this by drone. It's not even gonna be on foot, because... What the... Okay. Uh, do not fall down the hole. Oh boy, I have no idea what happened. Why did I get teleported upstairs? Alright, open that up. Get, ins get inside, because there's actual oxygen in here. Alright, we need to be at least leveled out. Alright, I get why. Alright, we're leveled out. Actually, I can do it this way. It's better. All right, here's the drone. I do have that equipped, right? All right, let's see. Let's see what's going on now. See how much neodymium we have. Oh, this thing's gonna take forever. But at least it's neodymium. I could actually use the crushed stone, but I don't really don't want to carry it. It's too much hassle for crushed stone. I think we, I think we reached it. I think we, actually, can't I, oh, I hate this drone. Uh, it's under tools, right? Now, the mechanical drill, yeah, I have a laser drill. Optical fibers, energy regulators, advanced electronics, titanium. It's actually relatively cheap to build. I should have actually built it. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. It's too late now. I'm gonna build it after I get the neodymium. Oh, you know, I'm gonna do this off camera because yeah, the drone's gonna keep annoying me. Ah, we ran into an issue. Uh, the mechanical drill requires biofuel, which is something that I forgot. I thought it was a drill charge, so I actually ran out of uh, fuel for this thing since I don't have biofuel on me. I used it all up. So, I have a choice. 
I try with the ship, the Neodymium is kind of far down. But I try with the ship, or I give up. And I'm probably going to try with the ship. I mean, it might get stuck, but I have a save, so at least there's that. <laughs> Hopefully it won't get stuck there. Problem is it doesn't have enough drills. It needs like four drills to up top to at the bottom. The wings will still get stuck though, so that there's that. There's just no avoiding that. So I need to build a relatively big hole. Dig a big hole. I guess I could do it. It's gonna take time, but it is doable. Basically I'll have to go like this. And just expand the hole slowly. Because our ship is too wide. If I had actually streamlined the ship, if it wasn't so wide because of the wings, because I wanted these wings for no good reason. I just thought it would look uglier that, like that. How we could have actually just dug a hole straight down, since it would have been a straight line. No, we're not. We're not mechanicaling anything. We're not drilling anything. I think I dr Yeah, I got a lot of rocks and nothing else. I trash these. We don't need them. Yeah, we're still getting rocks. Yeah, I'm gonna need to try this for a little bit longer. And we're full. Alright. So this is the best I could do, which is a lot. And we still have, what is it, 50% of this left? So that's, that's good. I was really hoping to be able to dig it out, but that's not really an option. And now I just need to finagle my way out of here. All right, us being full means it's time to go back. I will actually mark this location, just so I know. Oh, there it is. Neodymium deposit. It is Neodymium. It does say Neodymium. Oh no, it, it got removed because it was there. Alright, like so. There it is. Then of course now it is time to go back home. Now with this Neodymium, uh, that doesn't mean we can start building a... Uh, well, it means we can start building. It doesn't mean we can build. A capital vessel. Plus, keep in mind that a capital vessel is expensive to make and to keep. So, I'm gonna actually gather up a little bit more resources, even though if I do build a capital vessel, at least I'll have my base always with me. Which is exactly what we want. Well, I guess I could see exactly what, uh, what we can craft. And uh, then decide, because we're going to actually need to craft a warp drive as well, so there is that. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I've had to build a advanced constructor because our basic one was not cutting it, and on top of everything we were running out of room, so... We have a new container now. That's going to be filled with more junk. Anyway, uh, apparently we need Zuscosium for the laser drill which is uh, not helpful. For the AVA boost, we need one gold, which is not helpful because we don't have... What is that? Incendiary grenade. For the incendiary minigun. Oh. Oh, but I need a schematic, okay. And these are all the abyssal stuff that I can craft. Eventually a flamethrower fuel tank. Okay, yeah. All right. All right. Now, with all this neodymium, I can start building... <laughs> oh, we're gonna need sathium plates. Oh. Since I'll, I will want everything from... Uh, I think combat steel blocks? I mean, they're a lot heavier. I don't know which one upgrades to combat steel though. If it's the hardened steel, I will use hardened steel for the beginning and then upgrade everything to combat steel. And I think it is. Uh, steel block 8 large. I think the steel upgrades to hardened steel, but we do have actually titanium plates, I think. Yeah, we have 75. Not many, but keep in mind our first uh, capital vessel is not going to be big. Uh, now, that being said, let's see what we can craft. We can't craft shielding, of course, because that's a lot of power coils which we cannot craft. What else is it? Advanced electronics, high output capacitors, high output capacitors, advanced electronics, lots of titanium. So we are going to need titanium. And again, high output capacitors. So the reason I'm, I'm looking at this stuff up is just so, oh, sorry. Uh, so I know advanced electronics, uh, we are gonna need Sathium as well. Uh, advanced electronics, which is a neodymium glass. We do have neodymium uh, as an ore, so that's fine. It does require cobalt alloy though. So yeah, I was correct. We're gonna need titanium, cobalt, and neodymium. So we're actually gonna have to go out. But before we do that, 
There are a couple of things in the system. Hello, not here, please. The mini truck, there it is. Uh, one or two of these should be fine. Just, I uh, you know, just take all three of them. Yeah, we have only two of those. Uh, we can actually turn this thing off. No, we don't need it anymore. At least for now. Uh, I was gonna upgrade these. What is that? One glass plate, two titanium plates? Okay, I think we got this. One glass plate. And two titanium plates, if I do have that. Two glass, four titanium. Probably shouldn't have been put there, but whatever it's... Oh. Oh. I forgot about that. Okay. We're not going to be using this since we're not going to be using biofuel. Alright. We done? I think we should be. Yeah, our inventory is empty. Okay. I still have no way of really defending myself, but that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Now let us leave this planet. Because there is something up in the atmosphere that requires our attention. So last time around, uh, we did... Our, our, yeah, all of our weapons are off. We did find an RCS, right? And a medical station, and an oxygen tank. So what I'm gonna do is we do actually have some room on the ship, and it's actually a nice idea to go and ferry them over here, just so we have them when we start, uh, you know, building. Uh, but yeah, we will need to find titanium and cobalt, preferably around 500-ish, just like we did with the neodymium. Of course, I probably should expand this thing's uh, capacity a little bit more, just remove its combat capabilities at all, in general, and expand its non-combat capabilities. Just Make sure it's a mining vessel. Fully and fully a mining vessel. Now, where are we going? Uh, is it this? No, this can't be, right? Small vessel. Why is that small vessel locked in? Alright, I think it's this thing. Alright, so let's go check it out in that case. Pretty sure it's that thing. Oh, we're about to find out. I know I put a core in it. That's about it. Yeah, let's see. Now there is a nearby wreckage here. Two kilometers ish away. So we might as well check it out. Yeah, I'm pretty sure these are the ones I checked out. Like all of them. Yeah, because I I clearly remember that. <laughs> Where I thought there was like two, but there was way more than two. It was like what four of them? Hello, that's that's okay, that's fast. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we checked this out this one out. Like almost sure, but yeah, we have. If that's empty, and this is empty, absolutely we have. Let's go. Let's line up with the door, otherwise we can't enter. can't believe these doors are exact size. There's no such thing as a door that is exact size. Just... Don't believe me? Well, look at your own doors. Where's the... where's the marker? Wait, what? Huh? Where... where'd the marker go? Was it over there? Oh, is it over there? Wait a minute. No, no, no. Ah, we're checking. No, that's where I passed from. I came from the silicon asteroid. I think it was over there, wasn't it? No, no, no. There's the green. There's the green. There it is. Me slightly getting confused here, but that's fine. That's all fine and good. Let's quickly get over there. It seems like we're getting attacked here because there's like some light here on the roof that's flickering, which is really weird. Yeah, let's go take some uh, goodies. I really want to go there, but there was a enemy energy signature, so we're not going to be going there. Not yet, at least. Ah, oh, has it moved? It must have. I mean, I'm saying has it moved, but... Hello. Oops. We passed it. We passed it. Turn around. Make a U-turn. Alright, let's see. No, it was the green one. That much I remember. And I know I looted the rest of them, so... I can actually just do this. Just hug it. No, wait, what? Why can't I connect to the wreckage? I'm basically hugging it. Oh, oh, because it's not the right one. That's why. I'm hugging the wrong one. 
There it is. Now we're hugging the right one. Now there's an RCS that I will need to deconstruct. Come go away. Didn't I make didn't I make with this waypoint disappear? Alright. Wreckage. And uh, this thing weighs 1.6 thousand. That's too much. I kinda want the medical devices, but at the same time, now we need these plastic tube safetyum plates. Apparently I'm gonna need the safetyum plates now. Alright, let's connect that and let's go get the RCS. There's no point in leaving it there. It's gonna weigh way too much, but that's fine. There's a large RCS. I guess I could take some blocks. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Especially the hardened steel ones. The problem is, it's kind of cold outside, so I'm gonna have to do this in uh, chunks. Yeah, look at that. We're getting cold already. But, they are hardened steel blocks, so... At least, I don't... I'm still gonna need titanium. That's absolutely sure. I'm still gonna need titanium, but maybe not as much. Hmm. Alright, so I managed to find a uh, steel block here that was still intact, so I don't have to place one. of uh, One of the ones I took. And apparently, yes, it does upgrade to hardened steel, which is lovely. And hardened steel upgrades to combat steel, which is just, of course, safety employed. So that is perfect. This means I can start off with... The very basics, and of course I was doing this with a drone, I realized this slightly too late, but still. Yeah, uh, yeah now we're gonna weigh a lot. The weapons are not active. Yeah, we know, they're not active, that's fine. But yeah, uh, that's actually kind of nice, and uh, granted, I didn't get many blocks. We can't really carry too, too much. Uh, plus the RCS is like half of these, so I guess I can get around 60-ish blocks, which, surprisingly, if I do one or two trips, those are actually going to be more or less enough. Since, again, as I said, the first ship, uh, it, we're going to expand it. So my idea, I'm not entirely sure if this is going to work for Reforged Eden, I hope it does. But my idea was start off small, uh, you know, just basically a drive, a cabin, a constructor, and just a couple of thrusters. If we can, of course, if we can. Um, and... Uh, then from there on just keep expanding the ship uh, we're basically going to stay with the same ship we're just going to keep expanding it anything we need we just build a new room somewhere uh and that is it it's going to be ugly absolutely it's not going to be very very functional we might actually have to build a secondary vessel just for combat i don't know uh, but that was my whole idea uh, from the very beginning, so I would like to try that out. Anyway, we're going to end things off here. I am going to do this trip. I'm going to offload all the combat steel blocks and the RCS, which are actually going to help when we start building the uh, s s capital vessel, right? That was one. And yeah, it's going to be lovely, but we will need to find a little bit of titanium. Maybe not as much since we're not going to be building so many blocks, so I'm just going to take those. Uh, but we are going to still need to find some cobalt. Uh, at least for, you know, the warp the warp reactor and the all most of the parts we're going to need. So anyway, I've been the Rampant Mystic. I do hope you enjoyed this episode of Imperium Galactic Survival, and I do hope to see you all in the next one. Oh yes, I almost forgot. I was going to say this just before uh, I, I did my outro, but Merry Christmas to everybody. See you all.